Hey guys, welcome back to Ken Generations of Jewelry. Today I'll be making a lapidary cabinet for under 50 bucks using these and this. So let's get to it. works great for uh, polishing so far uh, but you know honestly everything I just did could be done with just simply an oil pan I mean uh, <laughs> don't need anything more special than that so here comes the next test the next test is to get that tile saw in there and see if I can actually slab rocks without getting water and dust and everything else everywhere for this next part I got the tile saw all loaded in uh, ready to go got some water in there I selected three rocks well, uh, first ones from Arkansas uh, my parents brought it back. I have no idea what it's in, what it is, or what's in it. So, cut it up, see what it is. I uh, got a rock picked up here locally. Well, pretty much locally uh, at a beach called Summit Township or Summit Township Beach Park, Summit Beach Township Park, Summit whatever. You get the idea. Summit something. Uh, again, so it looks like I have some quartz in it. Maybe a bunch of little other stuff, so a fun one. And then a rock from Marquette. Uh, this one is, like everything from Marquette, it has layers of banding, uh, or has layers of quartz and sediment, and I don't know what's in it. Uh, there's gonna be some quartz in it, and I don't see any agate lines, but uh, hey, who knows? Maybe when we start cutting it, we'll see something fun. So, uh, here we go.
cabinet works great. Uh, the tote cost about, uh, I think it was like $23. I think I paid it's, uh, just over 20 bucks for the piece of plexiglass at the local hardware store. Uh, about $5 worth of hardware, uh, screws and, or uh, nuts and bolts and stuff. And uh, works great. Self-contained. The only drips are the ones I gave myself pulling the... <laughs> Uh, rocks out so I can show you guys the slabs because my uh, GoPro battery uh, Either the battery or the uh, memory filled up either one But uh, Yeah Can't complain works great a little bit of work Didn't even have to stabilize the table. It did no vibration on it A uh, little bit of issue seeing through the surface of the plexiglass. Maybe I'll pick up a squeegee a little hand squeegee and uh, a very soft hand squeegee because I don't want to scratch the plexiglass but yeah, self-contained, no dust, no fuss, no muss. So, hope you guys liked. Hope you guys enjoyed watching the video and I will catch you in the next one.